Lake Naku National Park is very special to us at WWF Kenya because this is where our conservation work began in Kenya uh, in the 1960s. WWF Kenya purchased a piece of land and handed it over to the government of Kenya to expand the national park and this is where Lake Nakuru National Park sits. Lake Nakuru National Park is also very special because it is among the first black rhino sanctuaries to be established in Kenya. It is also the first um, rhino sanctuaries where the forward-looking infrared, that is the flare cameras, were installed to help curb the escalating poaching of black rhinos in the park. In 2016, WWF Kenya partnered with the Kenya Wildlife Service to combat the escalating poaching of black rhinos in Kenya. A pilot project was initiated at Lake Nakuru National Park, which is a critical black rhino sanctuary, and uh, whereby uh, thermal flare cameras were installed along the high intrusion fence line. Protection of rhinos has relied mostly on boats on the ground, but now, with the use of modern technology and training of rangers on use of modern technology and equipment, has led to effectively combating wildlife crimes like poaching. Uh, now, with the technology, the response will be faster and reaction time to the threats will ensure we do more of prevention than wildlife crime reporting when it has already happened. The support from WWF has been very instrumental in reducing poaching rates in Lake Nagru National Park. With the system now more efficient, we look forward to making great stride. Thank you for the support to protect our rhinos, our natural capital. In Swahili we say, Tunza Maliako. We are happy to unveil a more stable power supply for the flare cameras. The initial solar power supply installed in 2016 proved insufficient, leading to malfunctioning and ultimately leading to a failure of the technology. Data collected on power supply uh, for the flare camera system has led to the development and design of a more stable power system for the flare cameras. The new system addressed the challenges identified earlier, ensuring adequate uh, power for the cameras even during prolonged periods of cloud cover. The latest solar panels, capable of charging in overcast conditions, were integrated, significantly enhancing the system's reliability. The upgraded system now powers the cameras for up to 48 hours, even in complete darkness. And this ensures continuous surveillance and protection for the rhinos. This advancement marks a significant step uh, forward in conservation efforts, demonstrating the power of learning from past challenges and um, leveraging technology to safeguard um, the endangered species. We have now scaled up the use of the technology to other black rhino sites in Kenya, and this is in uh, Olpegeta Conservancy and in Solo Game Reserve. This is part of the strategies that are help us to deliver the goals of the recovery and action plan for the black rhinos in Kenya, of which WWF has consistently supported. The use of modern technology is very critical in ensuring that we achieve uh, rhino protection and uh, security.
We are celebrating a big milestone in Kenya where we now have more than a thousand uh, black rhinos. This is a great deal since uh, we are halfway towards achieving our long-term vision of 2,000 plus black rhino. It is also a great deal considering the fact that in the mid-1980s we had less than 400 rhinos in Kenya. To all our donors, supporters and partners, when, one, when a rhino calf is born in Kenya, it means we are one step closer to our target. It is also evidence of the impact of your support. We say thank you.